Welcome back to the review and today I'm going to take a look at this here which is the battery base with stand for the Echo Show 5. That's right, today it's about a product review, but before I start, if you're new to this channel, hi, my name is JD and I do product reviews like these. Sometimes it's art of books. I do acting analysis clips, I do animation analysis clips, rig reviews, animation news, all kinds of things. And if that's something that you like, feel free to subscribe and hit that bell button so you don't miss any of those uploads. That is the pitch, you know it, it's a YouTube pitch, but it helps me grow the channel. But enough about that, let's get to the product. I haven't even opened this, this is brand new. This was given to me, so disclaimer, this is, if you will, a sponsored product, because I did not pay for this. This was given to me, thank you, Zoe, by GGMM. They have patiently waited for the review. So that is the box. That is the side. Side here. Battery base for stand for Echo Show 5. And there you go. We got a little plastic in the middle here. Let's open this up. Surgically. Anything else? I think that is it. Ooh. That's what you get in there. Here is the ES5 setup guide. That looks like one piece you can unfold. Yes, it is. Deutsch, Francais, different languages gives you the setup guide of all of that. There you go, different languages, but let's look at this in English. So basically what happens here, you can take your Echo, put it on top of that, you can see the plate here, you can connect it, that's for the battery thing, and you have the stand at the bottom, so you can see this here. That, you got your stand, you can adjust, so it's not just a battery pack, but it's also a stand, it's very convenient. And I was absolutely interested in reviewing this because I have my Echo 5 in my office. My office is right over there. You can't see, I can't even turn the camera. But I have this on and I play Star Trek and all kinds of movies while I work. So it's always something playing. But it is because it is cabled stuck to that one area. And as I work out, I also have music playing or I play movies, but it's usually over my phone. And I was very interested in grabbing this and have that battery pack so I can take this everywhere. So this could be downstairs, this could be in a different room, this could be in the living room. It was always like listening to things, be it music or movies or TV shows, whatever so i thought this was really cool and i was very interested in trying this out so this is what you get this is the cover here you can unpack it like that you got this which i shall rip open here these are usually your packing thing is in there and there you go that is the size you can see my hand comparison here so you got little rubber feet so that it doesn't ooh, it really doesn't move i have to push this really hard so this is pretty good so it doesn't slide around then you got your power button here and here is your cable you will take this off and then connect that into your echo 5 and you got plug in dc in if you want to charge it like this it has a usb out so let me grab my echo 5 and then plug that in and see how that works there you go i got the camera closed here this is some dust on there because it never goes anywhere so you can see this here you're going to put that on there let me bring it up pop up bam you got a little click on you can see this nicely molded you can see how much you can see how closely this fits here and you can take this and put it right in here click that click and hold you see the four lights i'm going to go through the manual so you can see what that means i would assume right off the bat that this is about a full charge but I always like trying things out without reading the manuals. I know this is ridiculous, but just to see how intuitive it is. And I don't think this is going to be very complicated. You got your echo here, connect it. But you can see this here. You can see how you can swivel it around. This doesn't go, it doesn't turn. It doesn't do anything sideways or tilting. This is just up and down like this. So if you rest it like that, you can see it goes up quite far actually. And down. It's actually fairly heavy. It has a little magnetic connection there. You can see I can lift this and that battery stays put. So it's really durable. I can even hold it like this and it's no problem. That's pretty cool. So there's nothing that will kind of come off. I like that, that's pretty neat. Yes, 10.53, that is the time on the weekend. Alexa, play Star Trek The Next Generation Season 2. Here's Star Trek The Next Generation Season 2 Episode 4. That's how far into it I am, Season 4. Uh, it's episode 4 Season 2. Let me turn down the sound here. I don't want to get into uh, any copyright problems with the sound here. Oh, the outrageous Okona. Not exactly the best episode, but it's a classic. Actually, this guy, I think, was supposed to be the original Riker. But anyway, so you can see this again. Holds neatly. A lot of... Oh, as you can see that. Really clicks in. 
nothing happens here. I can go pretty hefty in my shaking here and this holds, it's very cold. So now you can put this anywhere, anywhere you want. Let's put this back here. You can see this, you can see this here. You can hold this here, it can go back like that. That's the range of the tilting here. So it's towards you and a bit back. It would be kind of cool to do either like a sideways tilt or a rotation, but I can see why this would be a problem because you got that cable here. So that is going to give you a certain limitation in terms of how far you can rotate. So it makes sense that you can do that. So that is the length. Maybe that's something in a future thing where it could have an insert here. I can put in the cable, then we unspool it and you have maybe a longer cable and maybe this will rotate also a 360 turnaround. Maybe, I don't know. But this is already pretty cool. So I'm gonna try this out. I'm gonna take this into different rooms, different scenarios in the garage where I work out to kind of fast forward and I'm gonna do a little bit of a testing there and I'll come back in a couple of days or a couple of weeks and see how this goes. I want to tell you how happy I am to be assigned to the- Alexa, stop. <sighs> still works, I've been playing since I unboxed it. Battery still going, three lights out of four. Yeah. Oh. Four so far so good. I love it. 12.5 million United States dollars. Still works. Oh, hi. Still working. Commander, come here. Bedroom time. Still works. All right, so I've tested this, as you can see, in all kinds of environments. Again, this is here, still playing. Absolutely fantastic, I have to say, and this is not because it's sponsored, and this was given to me for free. This would be an incentive to, to exaggerate. But I have found that I've been taking this everywhere, and especially when I work out and then go downstairs, just a quick thing was it's, I have to say, this with Alexa is a lot faster in terms of bringing up movies and TV shows and things I wanna listen to than when I do a Hey Siri. I had to pause there just to see that it didn't activate anything. So when I say, hey, ha ha ha, Siri, play whatever, Demolition Man, it would take actually quite some time to bring up and a few times it wouldn't even play. Like it brings up the movie, but I still have to go there and play. And for me in my office, downstairs, everywhere, I can just say, hey Alexa, play Demolition Man, and it's gonna load it up and it's gonna play it. And I don't have to touch anything. The sound quality is great. And with this, again, it lasts a really long time. And if you go on the actual website, so when you're on the page, you can see here product description and photos. It shows you everything. Feel free to scroll down and check it all out. You got all the information. You got size and weight as well. But what I wanted to look at is this here. It plays up to nine and a half hours at 50% volume. So I wanted to test that. And it wasn't at 50% volume, it was fairly loud. I would say probably 70% because again, it was loud working out in the office, all kinds of places. And I used it continuously and I used a stopwatch and it told me that it died after nine hours, 19 minutes, basically nine hours and 20 minutes. So at 50% volume, I can absolutely see this lasting for nine and a half hours. So this is totally true. I also plugged this back in because as you can see in the unboxing, it doesn't come with the cable. So the power cable that comes with this one, you can plug in here and you can charge it. What I tried was when it was completely dead, plug it back in and then charge it while playing. So it's not like you have to wait. So when you plug it back in at zero battery and you charge it while playing, it charges still and it keeps it up, but it takes here, it took me six hours, six and a half hours to charge the whole thing while it was playing. I was just curious because I wanted to play it all the time and not wait, but of course you can unplug this and just charge it just that without playing. Of course, then it will charge a lot faster. So overall, I would say this is really cool. You can see the size, it's tiny enough, not super heavy, heavy enough though to be sturdy and with the feet doesn't slide. And again, with the magnet here, that's nicely secured and really it doesn't come off. So I think the build is really cool. It doesn't get hot either. Again, at full volume and playing this and charging this, I am really, really impressed. And again, this is not just because I got it for free. I have to say, I've been testing this now every day. I'm playing this, I'm using this everywhere. It's really, really cool. So thank you so much for sending this to me. And if you have an Echo Show 5 and you're interested in a battery pack, check out the link in the description, go through the details. If that's something for you, it costs $39.99. Comes in black, comes in white, depending on what Alexa 
uh, color you have. So big thumbs up, two thumbs up from me. Curious if you have it, so let me know what your uh, experience has been with this. And maybe you have another battery pack that you prefer, or you think that this one is the best out of all of them. I don't know. I've only tested this one, but so far it's been really, really cool. I highly recommend it. And other than that, that's it for the review. As always, thank you for watching. If this was helpful and you thought, ah, that's cool. I don't want to miss any other uploads that this guy is doing here. Then feel free to subscribe and hit the bell button so you don't miss any of those set uploads. And other than that, I'll say thank you so much for watching. Thank you for taking the time to watch until the very end. And this is the end. And I'll say thank you. And I'll see you in my next upload.